Greetings everyone, my name is Adderville, and welcome to my let's try of the demo of Zolotl, a 2D metroidvania in development by Anger Games. Earth had no sun, but the gods had a plan. Sacrifices were held, and the sun was created. Movement was still needed, and Zolotl was going to be sacrificed. He didn't want to die, but his sacrifice was set, and his godly form was taken away. So he ran away. Title drop. I sure do. Um... Isn't yes selected? That's strange. It's the reverse of what I taught. Now I have a stick. So all creatures with white eyes are my enemies. That's good to know. If I hold down the dash button, I continuously dash around the place. I like the minor bounce he does when he hits the ground. It's cute. Controls are responsive. No issues on this front. Sadly, this game doesn't have a windowed mode, so I can't currently see what you're seeing in chat. It's annoying when games do this. In this day and age, Pretty much every game should have a windowed mode option, even in their demos. We obtained a key. Maybe it leads outward to the moss forest. Never mind to here. So this was mandatory. Typically there would be a faster way out, but I'm fine with this. This is essentially the last part of your tutorial. Once you're done with this part, you're all set for exploring the world.
to the forest. Wow, water in midair. Oh goody. Some of the mortals are now against us too. Axolotls are water-based creatures. They have no problem with underwater. In fact, they move even faster there. Yeah. Do I have a map? Yes, I do. That looks like a Metroidvania map to me. Like many other games in this subgenre, however, I wish we could have a mini map. Graphics are kind of basic. But I suppose they get the job done. I just wish they were less flat. The map's nice, but it doesn't mark specifically where in this section I am. Plus, the full map is unlocked from the start. We don't uncover it over time. To the temple. No map here. <laughs> Mini boss time. Easy. I obtained her talon. So wall jumping. That was an easy temple. It was only a series of tree rooms. Let's keep going down. That 
felt abrupt. Uh, let's try backtracking and see if there's anything else there. This demo went by too fast, and there was barely any challenge involved. Even Overbode was better in this front. We're back in this section. There should be a way to get up there. So either the map's wrong, or I'm missing something. Because if I go to the right, there's nothing up here. So I'm going to assume it's the former. So here are my overall thoughts on Zelotl. The graphics are... rather basic and flat. Same applies to the music. It's pleasant, upbeat, but very unmemorable. And the gameplay itself is also fairly basic. I know it's supposed to be the starting area, but I wish there was a bit more complexity here. Or at least place some hints as to the next area you'll be able to explore in the final game. I like how we get the wall jump, but we barely get enough time to use it properly. If anything, this feels like a pre-alpha to alpha demo. It's super basic, and only the core concepts have been implemented. So I can't properly gauge how this game will be until more stuff is added. In any case, Thanks for making this demo, Anger Games. I wish the best of luck to you. Well then, thanks for watching, and have a nice day.